What is wubbing? The first result on Google for the term wubbing returns a video uploaded to YouTube on June 27th, 2014 by user IDCA Life. Totaling nearly one and a half million views, this video has been received with much controversy. Some comments hail wubbing as the future of dance and human culture, while others decry it as being what is wrong with America today. This is the wub, and whatever you do with it is wubbing. It takes a lot of like endurance, it takes a lot of conditioning, really an athletic sport. When we, when we street perform in Santa Monica, uh -huh. we see the crowd reactions. They do this, they definitely do this. He just rushes me and, and puts the cuffs on me and arrests me. That was the reason that we most likely got arrested, because the people who were actually there was liking what we were doing. Whether you'd argue this is art or obscenity, what cannot be argued is that these gentlemen created something unique, which has become part of the YouTube landscape. It has been nearly seven years since this phenomenon was broadcast to the internet, and we revisit it here today to break down some of the finer points of wubbing. These are the shorts, mm -hmm. and this is the wub. You do it like this. Uh, uh. And you gotta graduate them. But, but if you don't point, then you gotta be the teacher's pet. Ooh. Yeah, we love to see you smile. What do you call it? Stir the mayonnaise. Oh. Next sauce. Next sauce. This is called the whip sauce. Next, next. Uh. Did it, did it, did it, did it. Hey, this is exclusive right here. Oh. Yeah, give me that. Give me that. Okay. Was wubbing born of idle hands or was it a guerrilla marketing exercise? The video's description urged users to check out wubbing.net, which since has been 404'd. Investigating the comments, we learned that at the time of the video's premiere, wubbing.net rerouted users' traffic to McDonald's website. Further investigation shows that this redirection was eventually changed to send traffic to Jimmy Kimmel's website. Many YouTube commenters speculate that the advent of wubbing is nothing more than a marketing tactic which subverts the norm by using guerrilla style placement and imagery which undoubtedly would be considered by some to be obscene. Theories are likely to remain speculation as neither McDonald's nor Jimmy Kimmel have ever claimed responsibility for the video. While wubbing has not become the international institution these men envisioned, there are a few things they'd like you to know. What you see here is a group of innovators, you know what I mean? Like, this is a part of my character, this is who I am. When you dance, it's, it's from the heart. We gonna be back. Best believe that. We're gonna be back. That's the